Ben with a B. Mm -hmm. Ben Gleave in the building, everybody. Very funny, man. Best known as the host of Idiot Test mm -hmm. and his podcast last week on Earth. Ben's been on with us. He's a friend of the show, and it's great to have you back. My Thank friend. you so much. I sold most of my Facebook stock about a month ago work. because I saw this coming. So I went from seven shares down to one share. So, so you're good. You're ahead of this. Yeah, but the general point of that is that I'm not at all rich because I think seven shares was like maybe like $200. Hey, hey. <laughs> no billions. No dollars more. Yeah, than what you had before. True that. <laughs> but you know what they, we just said that, buy low, sell high. So maybe get some more right now. Mm. It'll climb back up. Give it time, guys. Yeah, I, any company that supports Russia hacking our democracy, I support them. I want oh. to invest in them. I'm kidding. No, I don't. That's some messed up stuff. <laughs> Step up the security, Mark. Come on, Mark. Good Lord. That's Come on, man. I, I, I literally tried to run an ad recently for, for my upcoming shows here in Chicago, and there was a political joke in it, and they shut it down. They said, no political. I'm like, oh, now you're taking a stand yeah, against now political. Now this is the stance you're going to take. Well, speaking of your performances, you will be, for the next few days, performing at Zany's in Rosemont. So uh, that's going to be really great stuff. Make yep. sure you check him out. We'll be promoting that later on, give you the details. But you just posted this pic on Instagram. Man, I'm going to need an explanation. Uh, I'm going to need wow. an explanation. Uh, I need an explanation, Your too. Your nipples are showing. <laughs> Thank you. That's Thank not you the so only much. thing shown. <laughs> <laughs> this was about 15 years ago. I was doing an interview with Ali Landry for this show oh, I used yeah. to host for National Lampoon, and everybody kept calling her a sexy host, and I'm like, I can compete in the sexy host department. There you go. So I went with my girlfriend at the time, who I just started dating, and posed for that. She and broke up with you right afterwards? Yeah, I made her take that picture. She's like, what life am I living? She was working in a normal 9-to-5 job. <laughs> She did not like any part of that. I think I looked very sexy on the camera. You look great. So these Thank were you. your headshots. Yeah, they got me a lot of work uh, uh? in this town. You know, Weinstein was still around then, and he, he, he loved it. He loved it. <laughs> All right, well, let's chat about let's chat about your podcast last Please. week on Earth. Uh, do you have a favorite topic in which you tackle, or is it kind of a wide array? It's a pretty wide array. I call it Last Week on Earth because I cover everything that happened during the last week. So news, politics, pop culture, trends. But it's mostly politics these days. My stand-up is not. My stand-up's pretty just general, funny stuff. But politics kind of led you down this path where it, you... It did. I just got too mad about what was happening in the country, and I had to talk about it. And so I figured a podcast is a good way to dive deep. Oh, wow. So I do that, but I also tell personal stories. I also uh, might have just been very not sober <laughs> at Israel's Burning Man, and I told that story. Um, my first time experimenting with certain certain things. Can we share this now or no? Sure, I did ask it for the first time. Am I allowed to say that? Sure. Well, you just did. I, well, you, you asked me to elaborate. Said. I was trying to talk around it. <laughs> Let me just say, uh, uh, Steve Jobs credits it with helping it discover the iPhone, so I figure helping so, him think of it. So as that's long what, as you don't recommend it, it's okay. No, I don't recommend it. It's a very scary, intense drug. I did it only in the safety of the Israeli desert. I'm Jewish. I was wandering the desert. I figured we've survived worse than this. Okay. In biblical times, give it a shot. Uh, it was glorious. The, the, I was in this wooden bathroom and the walls started morphing. I was thinking of ideas for world peace. At least one of the seven ideas seemed not insane the next morning. So, And listen, here we are. Here What's we your are. master idea? Jobs has the, the iPhone. What, what did you come up with? Do you have well, My idea is that we need to have a, a global priority list. We have all these problems. We just kind of touch them. We never fully oh solve them. Oh my gosh, I love this you idea. Like this? It's like out of hand. It, it is out of hand. Like, yeah. I mean, we got oil problems, and then we got Russia problems. Well, we got problems in every respect. Every day there's a new distraction. We got to tackle one at a time. When yeah. you're trying to accomplish stuff, you don't do a million. You're eating a breakfast with 12 things. You're not going to have a little, you're never going to finish anything. Tackle those eggs, then tackle them hash browns. Well, you should run for office. Well,